The Experience Pros Radio Show, home of the original Fan Bragging Fridays. Take just 20 seconds to become a revolutionary by sharing a Fan Bragging story of great customer service on Facebook.com slash Experience Pros. Now, back to Angel and Eric, The Experience Pros. It is telling your story so it gets heard, understood, and remembered. Sometimes feel like Mission Impossible. Jerry Brown of Jerry Brown PR can help. Jerry's here on the Experience Pros Radio Show at this time every week with a tip to help you tell your story. Welcome back, Jerry. What's our storytelling tip this week? Well, our storytelling tip this week is inspired by the second best thing about Election Day. The best thing about Election Day, of course, is that we get to vote and yes. exercise our freedom. But the second best thing is that all those ads and robocalls finally go away. Do you promise? Hallelujah. Uh, yeah, at least for a day or two. <laughs> All right. And so today's tip is know when to shut up, <gasps> or if you want to say it more politely, know when to be quiet. Mm. Now, of course, we can't expect the politicians to do that before Election Day because they've got a deadline. They've got a date on the calendar that says, you know, you better say whatever it is you're going to say by now because this is when people vote and it doesn't matter. You know, tomorrow it doesn't matter what you're saying for the election that happens today. Now, most of us don't have a, a date on the calendar. It right. says, you know, this is the end of your message. You can stop telling your story today unless it's retirement and you're going off and going to quit uh, being in the business world or something. Sure. So, uh, but it still is important. You know, there, there are times when uh, the best thing you can do to tell your story is to just be quiet or it's not really telling your story. But it is there are times when you just don't want to be out there pushing what you've got to say. You know, Jerry, I remember a country song says you say it best when you say nothing at all. Oh, I like that. You know, mm -hmm. but but Jerry, I mean, I, th I think a big reason we bring you on the show is to teach us how to tell our story. Being quiet seems pretty counterproductive. If I don't tell it, who will? Well, I, I absolutely agree with that. And, and you certainly want to tell your story. You want to tell your story well, and you want to tell it often. But you, there are also times, I mean, we, none of us want... Uh, you or anyone else to be pushing your story and promoting yourself all the time. It's just overly pushy. And so there are times when you either just need to be quiet entirely or talk about other talk things. About, just be a human being. You know, Eric, I, or, um, Jerry, I actually made a mistake and gave my email address to a campaign and um, receive about oh, oh, oh. 50 emails a day. Now, they're not all from one person, but they're all about, about the election. And uh, I was chatting with my husband about that. I don't even open them. I don't even read them. They, I see them, and I just do mass delete because there are just, there's just too many. So I'm not even hearing what it is they think they're trying they're saying to me because and, but it's not just the campaign it's not just the politicians i mean this, this applies is, to newsletters it, well, and it to, to press all releases of us. And i mean if if you ever if, you know there are just people that they, they just never let up mm. it's like if you see them if if you know that if they open their mouth within earshot of you that you're going to be hearing about why you should buy whatever it is they're selling or whatever and you know what there are times when that's quite appropriate but there are times when that's not what's on the agenda. I mean, you folks here, I mean, how many times during the course of your show do you promote the, the Experience Pros? A lot, and that's perfectly appropriate. But you're also very good about when you're in other venues, you, you don't, you're not pushing the Experience Pros every minute. In fact, you're often out there pushing the rest of us uh, or just being humans and being friendly and, and, and being a friend with the people. And that's very important. It's very important to understand that, yeah, you want to tell your story, and you want to tell it clearly, and you want to tell it well, and you want to tell it often. But not at the expense of, of becoming numbing. Exactly. And so that's a real, I think that's as important to know, it's as important in, at, to know when not to be pushing your message as it is to know what your message is. Excellent, excellent advice, Jerry, because I think we do have to be really respectful of people on the receiving end, which is why we call you King Midas. Everything you touch turns to gold. If you haven't checked out Jerry, Jerry's blog and all the different different advice that he gives, it's really valuable in getting your message heard understood and remembered. Absolutely. You know, the late uh, uh, journalist, screenwriter, and Denver native Gene Fowler once said, writing is easy. All you do is sit staring at a blank sheet of paper until drops of blood form on your forehead. Keep your forehead dry and hire Jerry Brown of Jerry Brown PR to help you write your blog posts, social media postings, articles, press releases, power presentations, and more. Plus, 
He can help edit what you've already written. Contact Jerry Brown at jerrybrownpr.com. That's jerry at jerrybrownpr.com or by phone at 303-594-8016. That's 303-594-8016. Jerry, thank you so very much. Don't go anywhere. You're listening to Angel and Eric on the most positive business talk show in America. The experienced pros are here to help you get your business right. To learn more, visit experiencepros.com. 